Yeah, I don't know if I told you guys, um, <clears throat> the other weekend I went back to my, um, my old house, the place where I used to live, and, uh, went back to my old room that I used to stream FTN. Tiny little office space with, like, I had, like, a coffin to work with in terms of VR space. It's tiny. I don't know how I did anything in there. But that's where, like, everything kind of started, you know? It was weird to just look back at it. Thanks for being along for the journey. <clears throat> I won't vent too much. <laughs> that's not why you guys are here. But I do appreciate it. <clears throat> My fucking voice is going too, holy shit. You, uh, been at the lighthouse now? It's nice to get away from things. I wasn't sure if you were meeting someone up here, so I didn't really... No. Just taking some time. How are you? Uh... Adjusting. Plenty of entertainment. Oh yeah? I... I confess I've been... A little nosy. From a distance, of course. You've been spying on me. Yeah. I'd probably do the same. You, uh... Really busy lately, huh? <sighs> Comes with the job, I suppose. But, yeah. Haven't really had much time to... Do anything. Not many quiet moments, at least. Guess the lighthouse is good then. Right? Nobody's out here. <sighs> I'm doing a lot of thinking. I'm surprised. I wasn't really expecting you to, with... It looks like there's a lot on your plate. It's hard not to, you know? After everything. No, I got it. I... I guess what I'm saying is, is like, I don't... I'm not just waiting around impatiently, like I... For what I saw the last couple of days, like I said, you got a lot going on. You... I kind of understand now why it looks like you're carrying, like, two potato sacks under your eyes. <laughs> I got whole three hours of sleep last night. Yeah, that's... That's actually impressive, considering... You know, being as busy as you are. Um... But, like... Do you get a comfy bed, at least? Or like no. other pillows and stuff. I don't really um like beds. What's the point in being like noble if you don't get a bed? <laughs> you just get used to not being in one, you know. And then when you do get one, it feels seems like too trash. soft, and then. You get used to it, and you get used to having someone next to you, and then they're gone, and then it just feels weird, so I usually just find a chair, or I used to sleep on a couch, but then people more needing of it than me take it. <sighs> nah, I get it. After everything, I actually, um, I got a dog for a while. You got a dog? Kind of how you replaced me with a dog. Yeah. I know that's not kinda. I mean, it is what it is. I got a dog. That's because it was just the same thing. It was like you. 
one day it's like, like it's like your bubble is still really big because it was like built for two people and like when that person it just doesn't like yeah If, um... If you're still gonna, like, be around, and I'm not gonna, like, push you out of a window, or... do something terrible to you, we need to... figure some things out. Yeah, I mean... Uh... I mean, there's not really a, a rush, but if that's what you need, like, I... <clears throat> you need to be a hundred percent honest with me. With everything. And I don't mean that as in the, I won't tell you this because I'm protecting you or whatever the fuck. Yeah. I need you to... Because if I find out that you're not, then I... No, I get it. Um... Do you have, like... Question- like, questions? Or, like, is this, like, I don't... I'm just trying to... I don't know. I don't know how to navigate this kind of thing. Yeah, this you is, um... S said a lot the other night, and some of it went in, I was kind of in shock, and I didn't really... Why uh, are um... you here, in Nautis? Kind of hiding right now. It didn't really take too long after... Well, with what he pulled with you and the betrayal, it wasn't too long until suddenly he kind of pulled the same thing on me. I didn't really... It makes me feel really stupid thinking about it now, because, like, if he was gonna do it to you, I don't know why I thought I was gonna be any fucking different. I guess I was just being narcissistic at that point. But it was like... It kind of felt like loose ends or something. It was tying up. Like he wasn't happy. Like he assumed like maybe I was going to make a move for power. When everything went the way it did, like... I wouldn't say we were super comfortable because once you... It wasn't what we thought it would be. Working with the big guys, it was actually a lot worse. There was no more roaming the streets as freely as we did. No more time for anything fun. It was just a constant decaying underbelly of problems. and There was no secret that. riches or big fluffy beds. Yeah, why? Well, I... So, what? I just wanted things to be better. Edric sent you here to die, basically. Not really. It's a little bit more complicated than that. I started noticing that some of the jobs I was getting and being sent alone, like, they just felt a little off, I guess. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like... They were prepared. Normally... Kinda, yeah, well... I was usually the distraction. Mm. And then suddenly I'm running operations by myself, or suddenly the people I brought with me are not where they said they were going to be at a key moment. Getting out of... Okay, this one time, we were set to take somebody out. It was really wild. And then what happened was, is, is that I was supposed to stab the guy, get out, run, right?
Sorry, there were a lot of voices in my head. Anyways, I'm supposed to hop out a window. Hop out the window. There was supposed to be a cart there. Wasn't a cart there. Tumbled. Almost hit the ground. Grabbed Elijah last minute. Looked around. Nobody's around. I go back. I'm like, where the fuck were you guys? Oh, well, we didn't give him the signal. Signal. What signal? There was no signal. You were just supposed to be there. Little shit like that started piling up. And then one night, I was sent on just this ludicrous mission. Something about... God, I'd have to remember the details. It's all fuzzy because of how hard of a fall I took. I'd also have to ask God, to be perfectly honest. And then... There was just a target on my back. Everybody that I trusted when we worked together, suddenly they were just showing up dead, or they would die on a mission. So I got out of there. It just started to make a lot of sense, and I wasn't going to stick around until he realized I had caught on, and then suddenly I wake up with a blade in my throat. Do you still feel any loyalty to him or the Dreadknives? What, sorry? Do you still feel any loyalty to him or the Dreadknives at all? Not really. Like, I mean, it feels a little awkward not to be a part of something, I'll admit. Because... You know... I've always had a big bubble. And now I kind of feel... I feel lonely. I guess if that's how I'm gonna describe it. You know, it's... I felt like I had a family and now I... Don't. I so if I'm feeling. being honest, like you asked me to be... Mm. You know, I miss it, obviously. Not really the dread knives, though. The dread knives were... said really difficult. But just... Feeling like I belonged, I guess. Feeling important. Needed. You need to be, um... <clears throat> you need to become very useful very quickly. If you want to still stay afloat here. I don't know if he knows that I'm here, and, and it's kind of a... That's why I didn't come out right away, because I wasn't sure if you were meeting anybody, but... I don't know if he knows that I came here and I, I took up shop here after what went down the other night on the bridge, and... I don't think he knows you're here yet. Because I feel like if he did, I would have heard something about it before. Maybe he was keeping it from me. Maybe he knew. But if I knew? I, d I don't know, honestly. But I didn't hear a word of you while I was still working. When did it switch from working for the Dread Knights to not? <sighs> it's been a while. I definitely have to check my memory and get back to you. Right. But it's been a while. There are people <clears throat> in this town that desperately want to kill every fucking dread knife they can get their hands on. I mean... I am one of those people. I don't really blame you at this point. Don't blame them either. The issue is that you've been pinged. Really? They've seen a hooded woman around on the rooftops frequenting oh, places great. that I've been. <sighs> now, I can stop these people from hunting you. But you have to be useful. I mean, that sound as fair as a deal as any. 
I'm and gonna, a little more generous than I was expecting. I'm gonna ask for information on dread knives, how they operate, names, strongholds, safe houses, everything like that. You're gonna have to give them to me. Yeah, If you okay. can, obviously. I mean, I can give you the information that I had back when I feel like I was still getting active information. I'm going to assume that the information that I was getting before some of these missions went awry. It depends. Because like I said, my mission started to get really fucked with, so... I can give you what I have, but I would also take it with a grain of salt, because it was given to me... ...when I... ...you know, so... ...when you... ...go to take a look at these places, or take these houses, like... ...you have to be on guard. Always. But yeah, I can... We can go over it at some point. I can... Take some time to... Put something together and... Give it to you. That would be helpful. Brush off a little bit of thieves can't... In a while. Well, that should... Help to keep you alive, I suppose. Well, I appreciate that. It... It means a lot. I know it's probably not easy. And I'll help however I can, like I said. I... Also... Just... I didn't mean to spy, but I was kind of worried about you now, too. Just with how things have been going in the city, for me being here only a small amount, and you being... I heard Lord... Bur... Bur... Ern... Ern? Uh-huh. I... I... I got half of it. Are you like... How does that work? Did you... How did you even... Long story short, I got adopted. Wow. I met someone. So there's... I didn't know at the time he was a lord, but... I don't know. Every now and then you just meet someone and you just... would follow them anywhere if they asked, you know? No, I got it. So now you're just his... Do I say heir, or do I say son? Because I'm not trying to sound <laughs> disrespectful about whatever They're both technically is. correct. Uh, one second. Take your time. I... I'm really happy for you, and I don't just... Like, I hope it doesn't come off like I'm coming out of the woodwork because you've got this fancy title. Like, I'm happy to stay in the shadows and, and watch, and that's kind of what I guess I've been concerned about these past couple days. Like, with everything going on and the rumors I heard about some girl being kidnapped, like... I'm not saying you can't take care of yourself, but eyes on the roofs are better than none, right? I'm exhausted, if I'm being honest. It's partially why I'm not yelling and screaming or trying to fight you. I just... So tired. So empty and just... I'm kind of at the fuck it stage, you know? Yeah. I kinda... I went through a whole arc after that situation with... 
Well, when I when I hurt you. I'm not gonna dance around it. I'll just be honest about it. Please do. I <clears throat> begging and pleading is not you. <laughs> okay, listen. You can say that as much as you want, but any person will beg and plead for the right thing. Everybody's got that thing. Oh. <clears throat> it took me a long time to uh, deal with it. Like I said, my bubble. I tried to keep busy. I tried to... I think I tried to work extra hard to try and prove to myself that my choice I made was the right one. I'm trying to lie to myself, so I kept just taking work and sleep was a thing that I heard about. I never really got to experience much during that time. Yeah, I know. You'll enjoy this. Uh mm -hmm. this one time. Shortly after, I was so sleep deprived that um I was supposed to pickpocket this guy middle of the street. I can't even remember what we were doing, I was so half asleep. Um, I put my hand into his pocket, and I did not grab what I was supposed to grab. I'm just gonna leave it at it. Was, it was very- it was a- it was a horrible moment for me. Um, she so at least you've thing. never <clears throat> tried to take a man's coin purse. Is, um, that old hideout still there? I know it's been like years, but it's in pieces. It's kind of one of the only places I felt like I could sneak off and exist. And then I don't know if it brought up bad memories for him. When he did find out, he wasn't exactly happy. So he kind of trashed the place. It's not unusable, but it would need a lot of TLC to be comfortable again. We got it when it was empty and falling apart. <laughs> we made it something then. So if you're just kind of hiding out here, why are there so many Dreadknife operatives in the area? What's that about? That's the part that confuses me, because as far as I was concerned, we were staying away from Nodis for a few reasons. At least that's what he told me, but now I'm starting to wonder if the re reason why I was told we were staying away from Nodis, like I said, is because you're here. I really can't put my finger on if he actually knows you're here, or if he doesn't. Because if he would know, I feel like he would have acted. <clears throat> but, it's- like, I'm trying to get, like, two steps ahead of him whenever I think about it. Did he know you were here and didn't tell me because he knew I would feel bad? Did he not know and that's why you're here? Or does he know- like, <sighs> I can't wrap my head around it. You really think he's that good of a- card player that he's thinking that far ahead. Honestly, no, but between him and a few of the new people he's chosen to surround himself with, I feel like I, well, after what he asked us to do, I think that was the day I stopped really knowing who he was. There's always been this weird tension now. This, um, it was just like this electricity in the air that if I like said or did the wrong thing, I was gonna catch on fire. Walking on eggshells. Yeah, well, I don't know why anybody would do that. You. Why would you walk on eggshells? Look, don't. Okay. I'm doing this thing. It's like a. It's actually a. a cool really euphemisms or something. I don't know. Yeah, but like, think about it. Like, why would you walk on? Why would you? The walk idea around? is that you do it carefully, I suppose. But what area of space is so covered in eggshells that you have to go through them? I'm not a farmer, I don't- And they don't even make that much sound. Like... And if there's eggshells, the eggs are already broken. What? <laughs> I'm just saying. Yes. <laughs> yeah. We're going to need to bait out as many dread knives as we can to come here. And then kill them. Well, I've got a couple options. Uh, my favorite one isn't letting them know I'm here, but it is an option. The other option is letting them know that I'm here. 
Okay, well, let's assume that that's going to happen anyways. Because exactly. something tells me that Lord Kyler earn, 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 but I don't. That's, I don't. Listen. Okay. You're a drow, adopted drow noble named Kyler. I'm sure that news is going to spread. That's something people would talk about. The plan at the moment's pretty fucking simple. We just draw as many of them here and then kill as many of them as possible. I mean, if that's what you want, tell me what to do. Besides the information I'm gonna give you. I... I will say... It sucks. And you know, he told me to be honest. It sucks, because I really tried to lie to myself for years that maybe I'd, like, have a place, and there were some days that I thought maybe I would get along with some of them. I kind of always felt like I was there, but not really a part of it, and I guess there is a weird part of me that just kind of feels a little sad it's come to this. Honor amongst thieves, Ayla. <sighs> you ever think about, like... At the risk of sounding a little bit callous? I mean... Obviously what I did wasn't right. There's no getting around that. But... I mean, if we would have kept going the way we were going... Do you really think you would have lived long enough to be a noble son? I don't feel good about what I did, and I'm not saying it was the reason you are where you are, but... I guess what I'm saying is, is I'm happy to see that... You did it. You did something. That you're not gonna ever have to worry about food again, or... Convince me to distract a few marketplace stall owners while you steal oranges like a little monkey. They're tasty and juicy. You get like water as well as the food, and it's it it's good. I'm not arguing. I'm saying now you can afford oranges and pay people honest wages. You can pay for that orange so that guy can go home and feed his kids, or whatever they do. I didn't want this back then. Like, yeah, we talked about escaping into fancy houses and comfy beds, and I was happy with all of you, yeah. though. That's the thing. So, I probably wouldn't have been a noble son or whatever, but I don't know. Different paths. But now that I am, I have the ability to... <laughs> I've seen what it's like. You've, we've lived what it's like in those places. And I'm in a position where I can help those people, so they don't have to do what we did. There's I know. so I'm, much I blood on my I'm hands, trying to say. and I just... Kyler. I'm proud of you. You're gonna make a really, really great lord. You're never gonna forget, and you're gonna remember what it was like to be hungry. And I think that's really important when it comes to people taking care of other people in your position. It's a tough gig, though, if I'm honest. Like I said, I don't know if my face could handle carrying that much weight of potato sacks under my eyes. He's probably getting a good workout. Doesn't help that I usually fall asleep at a desk. A desk? Yeah. I sit and read missives and plan things and... <clears throat> Oh, that's gross. I don't like that at all. No. Nope. It's not too bad. It's just a wow. lot. 
you know, maybe that's the benefit of not knowing how to read. I don't have any of the responsibility. <sighs> okay. You asked me what you wanted me, you to do. It yeah. needs to be like this. You need to be beholden to me. You need to be working for me. You need to be one of my people. I can protect you that way. I can keep you alive. But you also need to keep giving me things. You understand? You need to be useful. Yeah, that makes sense. I don't know what be holden means, but... I don't want to say I'm your boss, because like, I fucking hate that, but... Holden something? Don't get ahead of yourself. I said something. I'm just... I, it's big... Smart people talk. You would be... I don't want to say I'm your boss, but it's basically that. Yeah, well, you know the weird part? Is I kind of always expected you would be at some point. Before all this. Kinda you were the one who way. basically taught us everything we knew. Yeah. Is this really any different than back then? <sighs> Difference. It is, but also not. Uh, there's similarities, I suppose, but. Yeah, no, I'm not trying to overcomplicate the. Um, minu minu minutia? Word. I'm trying to sound smart now. It's not you. working. Just, I Just be you. <laughs> well, look, I don't get it. I don't fucking get it. I don't get the fucking poofy sleeves and stuff like that. But like, I got a lot of shit to make up for. And even though you're tired, like I've watched you. I see the people you got around you. They're good people. I. I'll do what I can from the sideline, you know? Alright. Maybe after it's all done, maybe I'll find my people one day. You know? My family. You may have to deal with your family eventually. I don't know if you're ready for that. That's not a family. I shouldn't have made the choice I did, but a real family wouldn't have asked me to make that choice. Especially when you did nothing wrong. It's one thing if you had... You know what I mean. I do. You were nothing but good to us. So, anyways, I can get stuff together for you, I can go... Stake a place up. What? What do you need? Is this what I, boss? What is that meant to be? No way. I I don't know how people stand and address words. You know? <laughs> is it like this? Um, I got it. That's like a, that. that's exactly it. Yes, actually, you nailed it. Good job. I can hold it. I expect you to talk to me like that every single time we talk. Do you want me lower? Yes. <laughs> I can't do that. <laughs> I was waiting for it. <sighs> right now we just need to inform the Dread Knives. That way I can establish you as okay. an informant and someone useful and you don't get fucking stabbed in the dark. Hopefully. I need to procure some parchment. As for the safe houses, I'll have to put that information down, because you're going to need to follow it. But like I said, you need to take it with a grain of salt. When you approach it, you can't think you have the upper hand. Um, other than that, when I come and hand it over, I'll give you the names I do know. That being said, I wouldn't be surprised. The people I worked with, like I said, they're gone, so I wouldn't... Surprised if he's refilled his ranks. We're quite a few people he just mysteriously had die. God, he really became a fucking scumbag, didn't he? 
I didn't know he had it in him. I don't get it. Like, I mean... I... I get what motivated me. I know it was... It was greed. It was... Wanting more. Like, I was tired of being hungry. Like, I, I get it. And it's like... So I... I thought I understood why he did it too, but it's like he hasn't stopped there. Like he doesn't have to worry about eating. He has power. He's he's got the fluffy bed. He stays in a lot of places, so people like him and Grayson, they don't stop. And they don't appreciate what they have. I... They want the next thing. And when they get the next thing, they want the next thing. Yeah, I I, I get that, but he's my brother. Like I it was mine too. You would think that out of all the people, like... We yeah. wouldn't have been on the list. <sighs> that part's hard. You asked me to be honest, that part's hard. That's the part that would be hard. My hand would shake. So what would you have done if you didn't find me here? I was trying to figure that out when we saw each other the other night. I didn't know if I should leave Claudia because I have contacts here, at least a few that I feel like I might be able to safely tap to at least stay hidden or do a couple jobs or figure something out. I was like, oh, maybe we could go to Arland or the... Oh, probably not. East, but listen I don't know that was the hardest part and then you guys just showed up people were f dying left and right with your band of merry men what the fuck were you guys doing there Killing besides dread me knives. <laughs> cause you didn't it, those people weren't dread knives they worked for you though uh I was there alone. Like I said. What were you doing there then? Remember Just that watching? Hiding. I was hiding, and then I noticed dead bodies and people sneaking around. Like, I'm not gonna notice you guys sneaking around a port town. Well, then there's definitely. And then I thought, damn, they might be here for me. And then you guys started running at me. So I was like, damn, they're here for me. You remember that part? I do. You nearly took my fucking head off with a throwing knife. Okay. I wasn't trying to hit you, it was a warning shot. If I wanted to hit you, I think we've learned that I could have. I hit your friends. You did. Yeah, sorry about that. We were there for the mercenaries that we believed were working with the Dread Knives. We were pretty sure about that. So, they might not have been working for you, but probably some other Dread Knives in the area. We thought they were working for you. So... Specifically. But if you're telling me you're disconnected from that... Well, because if they were working for the Dread Knives... And I was supposed to die, and he doesn't want me around. Why, why the hell would you show up? What do you mean? Like, I would have... Well... If there were dread knives there, they would have known I was there. They would have... You know... One second. Turn around and look that way. This is not a in-character prompt. This is an out-of-character prompt. Ugh. Sometimes, my base stations just shut off. Oh no. 
Yeah, we love that. Ah, uh, the wonders of technology and how fucking frustrating it is. The point I'm trying to make is, is that I didn't have anybody there with me. And if they were there, they were there for me. So, I guess I kind of assumed, get... I just, I kind of assume that, like, I get it. I get it. But at the same time, I don't know who sent you. I'm trying to put it together right now. Because I kind of thought he sent you. No. No, there's definitely a group of Dreadnoughts operating in the area, whether or not they're working with you or not. They were spice farms here. They were hoping to supply the local law enforcement corrupt with spice and uh, serenity. We've dismantled that now, and we assume that you are running it. Well, at least I did. Oh god, no. I guess they're two unrelated things. I don't go near spice. But, when we went to... That's one thing I did not get involved with. When we went to that spice farm and dismantled it, there were mercenaries there that were hired on by the Dread Knives, and there was... people there, apparently. And we tracked the remnants of them that survived that to the town. That's where we saw you. That was a big argument we had a lot. I didn't like having my hands in spice or serenity. It's just... Yeah, killing people is a, the name of the game and honor amongst thieves, but there was just kind of something dirty about getting involved in something that could ruin somebody's life like that. Good people. Desperate yeah. people. It's not oh, fun. It wasn't me. Okay, well, we need to try and dismantle this cell of dread knives that's here. That's stage one, I guess. Okay, well... Give me... See what I can do. I'll, uh... There's a lot of fighting going on, but maybe I can see if I can sneak around and... At least... Do some of the dangerous work. Peek at some of these safe houses. Just be careful. I'll come back to you tomorrow. When you can. Days. When you can. Yeah. Of course I'm gonna be careful. Now I have to protect this... So noble puffy potato. Puffy potato. What? I'm, well, I'm not a sir. You know there can be purple potatoes. Can there? Found that out. Yes. I know there can be purple carrots. Okay, it's about... gonna sound really okay. So you can't judge me for this, all right? This is like that whole honesty thing. Oh no. So, man, I had a problem like anything purple for a while. <laughs> just like invoked memories grapes i found out that there were purple potatoes did you know that there's purple cabbage there's a lot of purple food purple flowers blueberries are actually of purple, purple in the world oh my no okay how this is how bougie i know you are bourgeoisie that's probably the better version of this is how bourgeoisie i know you are because you know what a blueberry is Okay, Mr. Fancy. It's a fucking. Why don't you go back to eating your blueberries while I yeah, go do some work? Berry. I don't even like them. No, 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 no. I have little seeds my, my in them my teeth. Shall I get your pillow for you to eat your blueberries? Blueberry pillow? You know, I, I just started getting used to people calling me my lord and such, and now I, I think I've just regressed several weeks. <laughs> what if I do it? Like, really drawn out. My lord. Is that better? What if I do it like that? I think I threw up a little bit in my mouth. I think I'm getting the hang of this bow thing. Let me, let, let me try it. Okay, ready? <laughs> oh, that's not it. Sorry. My bad. <laughs> Technically, you're expected a curtsy, but... Anyway. What the fuck is a curtsy? <laughs> it's like a bow, but for girls. <laughs> okay, demonstrate. I've, ne I've never done a curtsy before. Um, something like that. We've probably seen people do it. This is stupid. Yeah, it doesn't... doesn't suit you. You can bow, I don't care. Okay. 
I gotta make my own up. I gotta. What if I put the bow and the curtsy together? I the do that. Curtsy. I don't know. <laughs> I feel like the first one I did is good. I could just be like, my oh, lord. Oh, look at that. It's powerful enough to change the night. How did you do that? Damn. Well, while you were becoming a noble, I was becoming a god. But no, seriously, I should probably go get that work done. Alright, good luck. And as strange and weird as it is, it's strangely comfortable to talk to you again. It's just... It seems like a good enough place to meet, so they don't cause any problems, and... You know, it doesn't have to be a rowboat, but... If you just wanna... Vent. I might get there eventually. <clears throat> Have a good night. See you soon. You too. Be safe. Fucking blueberry pillow. Man, I wish I was rich. I'm Bitch, I will toss you off the fucking... Yeah? Come on, Blint. I <laughs> don't. I like that it does feel like old friends talking, you know. Maybe they're not quite friends anymore, but... <clears throat> Hold on, hold on, I'll run around the corner, there's one right here. Yeah. It's gonna go. Fucking so dark. Oh, fuck. Oh. Okay. Oh, hi. Holy shit. Ah. How'd you just appear here? Well, you turn the light on. It... Well, yeah, but then, like, I, I, I walked this way and I didn't see you walk this way. Did you come from over there? I've been around. <laughs> Good answer. Wait, you, you were looking for him. Oh, you were. We summoned him. What? What? You were looking for him. No, no. I mean, I talked with him earlier. For the, I did. Oh. Okay. Never yeah. mind. Sorry. And hard to understand. Got more fantastic news that I need to hear about, which I hope not. I wish I had fantastic news. Well, I was being more facetious and just assuming you were going to give me something terrible, but I appreciate it. Facetious. How? Wait. Say that word again. <sighs> Fascist. No. No. <laughs> no. 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 Are you a fascist, my lord? No, no, you're not. Look, I, I wouldn't say I am, but they have some good points on a few policies, all right? That's all I'm going to okay, say. Okay, all right. I'm going to go back to the tavern now. now I'm not going to get political two bloody anchors later. Or... I'm just saying. Uh, you're just saying. All I'm saying is, I get it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Got to control the railroad. Look, man, it was a different time. <laughs> Hold on, you're blind. Hold on. Yeah. Yes, I am blind. Thank you. If you could just find me a torch, it'd probably be... Oh, you could just turn all the lights on the streets. Um, that also works. Thank you, my dear. You're welcome. <laughs> Next one. <laughs> there's, there's. No, no, so you're going to break your... Okay. She's got a lot of energy today, it seems, despite being stabbed and poisoned. Well, she's taking a lot better than I would, so... Better than me in that regard, at least. So. 
thankful for that. Well, to be fair, I asked you what happened when you got shot, and you were like, yeah. Anyway. Yeah, exactly! Exactly! I mean, fair. look, it's... It's, it's, fair, it's, fair. it's like getting shot. Like, I didn't bleed a lot. It just could have gotten lodged in, like, an organ, and I probably might have died. Is it time? I did get poisoned and Hi. stabbed, so... Hi. Um, right. Yeah, talk to me. Okay. Oh, uh, time for one more round. Okay. Yeah, I'll be around. Uh, I assume... Well, if they're going out into the middle of the night, I assume they're going to want you, my dear. Well, they should ah. hang around. So, like... Those okay. From the gods for the nails. It's nightfall. <sighs> I haven't heard a fucking word. And the only word I have heard is that Robert Baron's men have been pushing on all eastern fronts. Damn near close to this goddamn city. So, actually, could you go get forever. Tori? She just ran off. Oh, uh, fuck. Or I can go get her. I Let's can. meet in here. Gonna need you. You already armored? <laughs> You good so, to go with us? Hold on. We're, the Robber Baron's men have pushed up along all the eastern fronts and we're still doing this. If we wait any longer than tonight, all those supplies are gone. Okay. And I need them for the wall. Yep. We need a cart. We are risking tooth and nail. The cart, I believe, should already be there. Okay. Because remember, they had brought two carts to get the wood. But since there's no word, it should still be there. We need climbing gear. I'll go get Sig. People who can sneaky sneak. Armored folk like you and I. In case things go horribly wrong. That's what that we're there for. Okay. You managed so to find let me go uh, grab Lisa. a few well-intentioned individuals. Yes, we need Lisa. She will be Strap most invaluable. For nails. Ooh. Lovely. Okay. I'll bring people here. Alright, I'm Those going... Knives. Oh, I can't get me a lamp. Fuck. Wow, you're really fucking strong. I grab my fucking thing by accident. I, I lift sacks daily. What a sack. I need to go urinate before we do this. I'll be right back. Wait, wait. That's right, you're lighter than a sack. <laughs> Alright, back in a second, chat. Always pee before combat. Pro tips. He's doing stretches, that's okay. Didn't do a very good job of hiding himself. Brad! We love this well, we Brad. Don't watch him, he's uh... Relieving pressure. I wanna even know where where's my... Brad. Brad. Oh, there it goes. Are you taking his food? Thank you. I'm hungry! Mother, so so you're taking right his in. food? I'll pay you back! Why are you so hungry, man? Leave me alone! Your, your father is literally... <laughs> children. Oh, having children. Children. Don't Shut up. Wrong, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna have to kick your ass, old man. I would love to try, try to see that one day. Good luck. I like to try to see you kick my ass. Tordy, don't speak with your mouth full. I took an arrow for you, okay? Oh no. You're not allowed to. Don't worry. Knock, knock. Bolt. 
What'd you do? I stole some of your food. bread. I'm okay. so hungry. Clifford. Harry. Arrest this yeah. fucking trash. <laughs> I'll get the arms, you get the legs. I'm reminded of a small child named Aladdin. <laughs> Shit, wait, she's got a sword! <laughs> you idiot, we all have swords! So, we're getting ready. We're about 10 to 20 minutes out. So if y'all have anything you need to get done, now would be the time. Alright, um... <sighs> Get people going. We should. Are we riding out? What was that turn? Are we riding out because we only need someone to take the cart back? Toti, can you drive a cart? Horses should um, be there. No. We'll be going on foot. Fuck, okay. I can drive. Yep. I just need light. Is this something I should be appraised to or no? Um, well, I could tell you what it is, but at the current moment, um, need you here in town. Going to the logging camp, because all of the wood that was meant to come back is still there. And robber baron men have taken the whole place, and I assume Bargo and his men. Unfortunately. So like I was telling him, we have 10 to 20 minutes... Of the free time. logging camp? Yes, or the logging the camp. It's right camp. there. No, the logging camp. It's right there. We just rode by it. Well, the very least, I think it is much needed intel. Sure. Oh, go ahead, sir. I was going to say, uh, apparently there's cavalry there, so. Oh, okay. Sweet, sweet, sweet. At the very least, four or five horses. Okay. Few with crossbows, couple with spears. Uh -huh. They chased us into town. Right. We took the iron from the iron mine, brought it back <clears throat> in order to help the city. Okay. They probably moved their operations forward to the logging camp, so that's probably what you're getting into. <clears throat> We whittled away some of their numbers, but by now they probably reinforced them, so be careful. Thank you, Tim. That is valuable, actually. Okay. I brought my Secondarily. stuff. Secondarily. Just in cases. Nice. Nice. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, we got 10 to 20 minutes before uh, we try to get Sig and uh, Lisa. Two steel ingots in your inventory. Add them. Oh, we'll nice. add them. So if y'all have anything pressing you need to do uh, now, would be the time. I got a piss. I'll be I right back. Enough. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Torty always, always having Two to go make her salad. Two different things. I got the uh, Give me a I got a race like a piss horse. I got a piss. Wait, what? I got a race like a piss horse. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, ladies. Can't talk right now. I'm making <laughs> piss. I'm making piss. God. So this is who you're taking to get the logging camp back. Just the resources that are there. That's usually how it goes. They have, but... they have Bargo and his men, Tang. I can only assume, if they're not dead, that they have them. Tiberius coming well, or no? Hey, Sigvana. I hear there's cavalry <clears throat> there. So, we're going on foot. Yeah, is. Climbing. Yeah. Have you talked to Tiberius? Mm -hmm. Good luck. 
I saw him earlier. So he should be around here at some point. Yes. Do you want me to look for him or? Um, I guess in a few minutes, if he's not here, I can go look for him. Hmm. Might still be around. If you need, you can go out and look. I can update anybody who comes in asking what we're doing. Hmm. Sure. <sighs> we have time. So, just, uh... Getting things ready. Does everyone have medical supplies? Oh. Just bought a potion and I got a bandage on me. Same. Hmm. I have a potion. God, this is tricky. I'm gonna think this out. It's night time now. But not everyone can see in the dark, so we'll still need to take lamps with us. But we don't want to alert our position, so we'll have to turn them off as soon as we get kind of near. <clears throat> so where we are going is going to be very close. Right. Uh, you can take us pretty much there. Uh, I would imagine, what, through the vineyard and out that way. Around that way. Yeah. Okay. Right. Well, if, if Tang told us there's cavalry, that means there's going to be patrols. Mm. And there's probably going to be people here in the town itself. So. Right. Hey, good to see you. Are you good to fight tonight? Good to fight any time. <laughs> right. I could use your help. Ooh. I don't about know, Marcus, ten minutes. you should be cautious hmm? about next to cots. Cautious? Yeah. Hmm. Remember what happened to us? Yeah, we did get run over. It's a bit tricky. I mean, well, the we're going to have to do the say... same thing that, we're gonna, hmm? that we did earlier. Hmm. Essentially, we had to push cart along because the iron was too heavy for it to be able to go up go up hills normally. Ah, I see. Hmm. So if we're bringing Still back enough that lumber, that's always... gonna be a problem. <laughs> like I said, if you exerted yourself earlier. <clears throat> May want to rest tonight. Okay. I'm back. Welcome back. Welcome back. That was loud as fuck. But welcome back. What the fuck? Is that? Chicken up yeah, there? you frying chicken up there, Tordy? What the fuck? Yeah, you frying like <laughs> straight <laughs> chicken <laughs> fried <laughs> steak up there. I don't know. <laughs> You're just jealous. He's torture. Oh, you got you got great flow. That's right. Oh hi. Hey. We're we're heading. I'm heading home. Um, but I want to let you know, the Merchants Guild only has two of the glues in stock, but they want it 75 copper a piece. So I just want to let you. Oh, I can wait for you. It's okay. I I know. Okay. All right. Y'all have yeah. fun. Cool. Be safe. My brewery is yeah, back and open, so I can make glue as well now. Oh, uh, that that goes Yay. one of the people that we need. I don't know. Actually, now that you mentioned that, I will need you in town looking for anyone who's coming through the walls, because they're not done. 
you better not. Be Especially the areas that are right Or there. just, you know, getting the guard, you know, escalate to the guard, that they might be coming through the walls. <sighs> through the walls, through in the, the roofs, fucking walls. the underground. Because if the robber bear men are this close, they could just come in plain oh. clothes. You know, no papers or nothing, just enter town. Did I tell you about what happened to me last night? What happened? Two fucking guards showed up in uh, our uniforms, and they're like, Hey, your father wants to talk to you, and I'm like, that doesn't sound like him. And they're like, yeah, that doesn't sound like They're like, no, no, you have to come with us. I'm like, okay, I'll get my horse. They're like, no, 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 it's it's much better if you walk with us. And I'm like... Does anybody need flash powder mm -hmm. before I go? Because this is the last you'll see me. I'm going home home. I'm good. That would be prudent. Um, I'll take one. I have something already filling that slot. Just in case. I'll pay you if I end up using Right. Well... Later on, it's a. If you end up using it, it's a silver 20, okay? If you don't, you can just give it back to me. <laughs> okay, yeah. Alright? There you go. Yep. Oh, and the Wood Elves love the stove you made. They love it. Mm. Thank you. Yes, they can actually use the oh. crops that I made for them. Good luck. Uh, Kyla, could you please look for Mr. Tiberius? I think he might be around town. Although he's kept pretty low ever since the recent, um... One righteous drow coming right up. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Hi. Have you seen Tiberius around? Okay. Thanks anyway. You still have that coin in your mouth. She has eight of them now. Uh, nine. <laughs> Don't like swallow them. Tubes. Yeah, I Alright. Alright. Sorry, gentlemen. It seems I'm being pulled away. Try to take it easy. I can imagine that. I find doing drown things. Be gone. You should um get your armor if you have it. Don't make it sound so malicious. Oh, it's currently with uh, Torty. Mm. All right, we'll just prep for a She's fight. Around. Maybe I can snag it up. She's actually at my house, where we're going. Oh, well, that'll make things easier. <laughs> yeah, that's who I was looking for. Thanks, Arco. Great job. Evening, Lord. 
evening. Mr. Sanders. Send me some durs. Yeah. Careful, you might sing him a song. <laughs> Make them the cutest herpity derp derp. Bow, 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 bow. <laughs> you know that one too. Uh, huh? What? Oh, yes. uh, yeah. Whoa. Whoa. But this is Dire Straits. Not even to save Bargo. Uh, of course to save Bargo. But also the wood. Of course. I heard that's I guess I'm staying that's here That's right. Then. You need your armor. I grab it. Oh. Oh. You're hey. coming left, right? Hello. Huh? Um, I already paid you everything. I actually, I actually need your services no, okay, tonight. Okay, never mind. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> I'm just kidding. Oh. Did you manage um, to talk to any of the guards, Marcus? Since we need to end, we need to have a bit of legitimacy to this. We need one of the sergeants, I believe it was a Stefano. <clears throat> All right, gonna have to go find him around town. He needs to be with us so he could see what's going on and to help us on the way back. No, oh, thank you. <laughs> going to the logging camp. They have, I presume this to be the robber baron's men, have taken Bargo and his lovely associates, and there's a shit ton of wood just sitting there. So I'd, we'd like, I'd like, love your assistance. And helping us with that. <laughs> Sounds like something that's needed. Uh, is there anything I should expect? Well, uh, we were being apprised by Clifford here. Uh, there may be some patrols, some traps uh, in the woods, so we shouldn't take the roads. Kind of like a straight shot, thanks to uh, Sigvana. She'll lead us. Calvary, well, um, commanders. Uh, oh god, well, that's quite a, a lot oh, of anti-armor. A lot of anti-armor. No, so I mean, no, hey, wearing plate, they'll be we're not going to go naked, but armor still armor. Uh, so, uh, well, thank God for leather then. Armor is better yes. for that. <laughs> do, 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 uh, do, do, if my do, honest do. opinion, based off my own experiences from the road. <laughs> Away, you're taking the south road past the embassy towards a uh, far too dangerous. They've already spread out and based on the ambushes we were seeing just last night, just but sudden death, and they'll spot us from a mile. Hmm. Uh, okay, your best bet is to go take a long route. Um, yeah. Maybe the road to Cassetto, there's a way through the woods there. Yeah, there's a it should be to reach the one by Quite right. the gathering, huh? Welcome, Stefano. Hey! <clears throat> Good to see you. Quick DM check. You. Gonna go one by one, just tell me where your armor value is. So, tell me what this plan full is. leather. Uh, plus four? I I've think? gathered a bunch of well. Plus three. Plus full leather is plus three. Leather plus two. Okay. Because Bargo. Not full, understood. A bunch of his men in the wagons. Try to get the wood back. A lot I am not going on this mission. I've been advised to stay the man's men have pushed their line. Understood. Roll your death roll. <laughs> so I'm hoping he's still. Yeah. Alive. Thanks for the I'm never. I'm never, I'm never no rolling your death roll again. He's a, anyway. he's a minor lord. You know, I know. Plus five, plus six. So maybe they'll sense. still happen. We need to get him. Full of his men alive. I'm giving you plus ten because I to like get the most. Get there. Wait, am I plus two? Sneaking. It's okay, we some now. Uh, light on us. I'm he doesn't have full leather. They might have full patrols, leather. so we need to That's fair. I deserve take that. care of that. It's just the chest people. Full leather. Deal with the rest yeah. of the No, okay. it's, it's full. Get Bargo. Maple, when you're done. Oh, armor. Armor value. Red diamonds, armor, leather. Alright, I'll give you a plus three. Steel plus one. You plus six, you mean? What? 
Oh, I remember saying man, this, that's some shit. weak fucking steel, <laughs> man. Um, it is full. I forgot I grabbed yeah. arms, old armor, and turned it into a yeah. mine. So it's full leather. Understood. <laughs> and maple, <laughs> one more thing. Just one more thing. Uh, Lisa has a flash powder and an advanced healing potion on her person. Mm -hmm. And because I know the nature of this dynamic, I'm actually going to check something for you right now. Understood. Um, once we get done, on the way back, need you to get uh, the gates open. <laughs> Lisa just rolled an 18 for something. You'll find out later. Like, on the way back, you make sure the gods don't shoot at us. Because honestly, thank you. I have Fenton yes. at the northern gate. He should be ready for a signal. That's our. We'll have you door. charge towards the gate, saying, "Don't shoot." At us. Oh, also, yeah. in the event that there are javelins, what's Arn's armor? Remember, <laughs> thunder and lightning is the passwords for most. Okay. Thunder and lightning. If you approach and you hear thunder, you respond with lightning, and you'll be let in any encampment we have. Gosh. Speaking of which, young lord, mm. we've got reports of. C Siege weapons moving. Roland's writing up the report. He will be sending that to you tonight. You are reminded. Understood. Yourself, Thank you. I got my men back from the camp. Yes. Mm -hmm. They won't be able to push past the embassy though. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, we'll see. Mm. All right. This is everyone. Double checking. Does, does anyone other than Torty and Kyler have stealth modifiers? All right, half of your NPCs. And... Yeah. This is everyone, right, Marcus? <clears throat> this is everyone. Okay. <clears throat> so, I'll kind of go through a walkthrough here of our plan, and then we will just go on and go, okay? The Robber Baron's men have pushed their line all the way up to the logging camp. That's where we're headed. Sig, you're going to help us, help get us there. The best possible safe route. We can't take the roads, so we're gonna have to go by your call. We'll have lamps and lanterns, but in the case where there's patrols, we need to take them off. Drow, you're going to help us see through the dark and find us the best path through these patrols. If we have to take them out, well, I leave that to the more stealthy folk uh, to go ahead with that. If things go poorly, and I mean terribly, we're talking alarms. Us in more heavy armor are going to take the front. All right. Any ranged we have also uh, to support us. Also front line here as well. Tori, you as well. Maybe you can catch some people by surprise. <laughs> there you go. And we try to get Bargo and his men. We try to save lives today. That's our main goal. The wood is very nice. That is the secondary objective. Need all that wood to come back here so we can build the damn walls. The sergeant mm -hmm. here is going to make sure that the guards here do not fire at us. <laughs> that is very clear. And like you said, if you should go down, the code phrase is they say thunder, you say lightning. Okay. If you do not respond with lightning, you will be shot on sight. You'll be just Remember shot that. until you're dead. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Pretty clear cut with that. I hear they have cavalry, commanders, and they've got their own hierarchy. They've got anti-armor and traps. Yes. Are there any questions so far with this? <clears throat> I think we're good. Anything Probably a chain of command, right. if I would. So that way, we all listen to one voice. If we stop fighting, we're going to die. True. Okay. Well, as per, uh, since I am in the Lord's house, I ask for you. Uh, do you wish to take charge on this? You've got more information on this than I have. You take charge, and I'll be a second. <laughs> all right. I trust you, Marcus. And after you, who do you nominate? Thank you. If, if I go down, then we're fucked. So... I know. <laughs> I know, trust me. I suggest the sergeant. Hmm. I'm in charge of my own men. I don't need to be in charge of yours, right? <laughs> I uh, we'll get to that when it comes to it, right? About... Right. <clears throat> all right. If We're all good. Down... Let's sneak our way to a god's damn logging camp. Sig. Mm. 
We follow you. Well, we will need two lights. You have one, and you have one. Okay. We'll do we'll, we'll do with that. After you. Does anybody want the potion What's I bought? The best way possible. Does anyone not have a potion? Hell I'm here. Okay. I guess we're good. Probably got the. Definitely oh, not the back. Right at the front door. Okay. Um, okay. Mm -hmm. All, All right. right. Well, we're already, already fucking up. Gaps in the walls. Make sure there's no. Already. I think it's too much for me. I'm in the garden. Mm. We'll judge it when we. We're going to the <clears throat> eastern gate. Hmm. Okay, Eastern Gate. Eastern oh, Gate. Eastern Gate. Where we going in poor armor? <laughs> We're just out for a walk, man. Torty, Lisa, come with me. We'll go this way. Neither of you better go down, okay? All right. I got a tier three potion and a tier three antidote, just in case I get knocked out. Aaron, if you mind, I guess getting a light at the front with Sig. Okay, on you. Dro, stay out of the light so we can mask our numbers. How are you feeling after earlier, Torty? Um, <clears throat> I'm finally sort of uh, sobering up a bit, so I feel a dull ache in my shoulder, nothing more. Okay. Otherwise, I'm fine. You're lucky Zaz yelled at me to stop drinking, I'll say that they're not so good state to go. Friends are behind us. Yes, <laughs> they're moving uh, in the shadows, of course. If we see anything along the road, dive <laughs> into the goddamn oh, fucking brush. I know what's out here. Let's double time it, Let's get ahead and see if we can see anyone before they do. Okay. I'm following you. like we're cutting in. Mm. 
There is an odd, a chill in the air. The breeze is harsh than quiet. It's getting colder. Winter is on its way. Well, thankfully it doesn't get too cold in Gradia. No. As you proceed in, Kyler, you immediately take note how the ground is soft, almost squishy. There may have been localized rainfall earlier today. The ground is wet, and you will need to be careful as you move. I am just going on whatever heading they're going on, trying to stay ahead of them. Ah, uh, okay. These woods are- Pause. Perception. Hmm? Kyler, with a 1, you notice nothing. However, Torty, with a 14, you hear voices ahead. Lights up. No, no. I see them. Drow, we're gonna go up ahead, see what's up ahead, we'll come back to you. Alright, be careful. Two rubber baron men. You want us to let them pass or you want to take them out? He said two men. Two men. The less moving parts, the better. She probably took them out. Understood. We take them out. We take them out, you go right, Torty go left, encircle them. Okay. Rolling stealth? So why the fuck are you doing it? It's the middle of the fucking night. Some animals could just come out of nowhere and- Kyler, your grand total is a 12. I have I friended the foxes so far. They like berries. Um, Don't worry about the wolves or the bears. <laughs> See, that's the thing why I don't understand why we're out just here. Just calm yourself. Listen, just stay vigilant. Best case scenario, we find some radar patrols. We take what they need, have, or we get find some game. It's not. It's simple. It's, just need to regroup so the lads simple. back to camp. It is! I don't want- uh, It's suicide. You, you guys are just antsy because you got picked on for night patrols. I'm not that bad. Well, I have to for sure fucking death because well, there's only three of us out here with a bunch of squir- I uh, was it? I can use the are fucking Are you afraid crickets. of squirrels? Are you serious? Come I on, man! You killed when I was a kid! You have killed Bye. men! <laughs> Back to the others. Carry on. Good job. Good 
Good shit, Tori. Well, it's not in there, yeah, I've been watching you. Figuring out how to do the feet thing. I would like a hand, though. I'll cut you Left. Rolling perception. <laughs> With a seventeen, you smell danger down the hill. Something down that way. Lights up. Or down that way. Down the hill. Oh. Don't see shit though. Don't see anything. Let me get up here. Tyler. Where? You hear a voice, a word cry out. Please stop. <sighs> Torchlight. Come on. Torty. Fucking stupid looking. <laughs> no, 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 Follow my voice. I will take you to. Come on. Come on. I swear my name as Tiberius. Come on. Come on. Take my hand. And do you say anything to when I say lightning? Thunder. The correct is thunder, and we say lightning. <laughs> Looking at this man, you all can see he is horribly wounded, bruised, battered, and he's limping. Oh, you want a shoulder? I didn't think the captain noticed I was gone. You yourself lucky. Sergeant? <laughs> you wouldn't <laughs> sure that this is your man. 
Relight if you need. Okay, good. Let's go. Dodge your face. Come on, Dory. Do I have a DM? We're good. All right. Back to the group. Okay. I... If... Way is clear, I can make it back, sir. My leg's still way is definitely clear. The way we came is safe. Okay. Go back that way. You'll see our climbing gear on the rocks. Be safe, okay? And you see Sergeant right. Roland, you go get yourself some medical attention, okay? All right, sir. What's the situation? That's speed. You, you can see the front lines way back up there. Get home. A few torches and whatnot. Thank you. They're a little spread out. Are you? All right. We can... that way. It was a good call on clearing these patrols. We need to go quick. Oh, these men are being... Which way? Alright. Sig. What's the best way? Up there? Okay. We go there down. We go. Because there is a path behind the lumber mill. Back that way. Alright, we're almost there. I don't see a way down, do you? Gliding and falling. Wrong direction. Look out the way you went. Fantastic. travel through the night in front of your group, you hear the dull thuds up ahead, rock hitting wall, distant shouting, distant fighting. It's far off. You know where it's coming from. It's hard because every inch of you tells you to go in that direction. Every part of you urges you. To grab whoever you can and relieve your father at the embassy. But you can't. Anything wrong? No, just thinking. Tonight, young lord, that is not your mission. But you promise yourself in the days to come, starting tomorrow, you will do everything in your power to get him whatever.